at the outset on behalf of the indian army we welcome all the pilgrims to this year's 62 day long shri amarnath ji yatra you all are aware that along the southern route the 32 km long trek from chandanwadi to the holy cave is the traditional route for this holy pilgrimage the indian army has been steadfast in its preparations in sync with all the other stakeholders that is the shrine board jammu and kashmir police the central armed police forces and last but not the least the civil administration you also must be aware that this year our border roads organization has done a human service in opening the critical southern route and that's also after heavy snowfalls in this season we had also heli inducted plant equipment and that's how snow levels of up to nearly 12 to 14 feet were cleared in quick time as far as security is concerned we have multi layered security arrangements in place with deployment of indian army troops the jammu kashmir police and detachments and companies of the central armed police forces also there is a 24 by 7 seamless integrated surveillance plan in place we have put in our assets which includes the quad copters other aerial assets as well as the night vision devices to have constant monitoring of the entire route apart from this our deployment and domination caters for any threats emanating from the higher reaches as well as the hinterland and the valley floor while our entire security architecture is in place we are also cognizant of the aspirations of our kashmiri brethren and each man of the security forces has been advised to ensure that there is minimum inconvenience to the local population in executing their day to day routine our special focus has been on the humanitarian assistance and disaster relief operations the last year's lessons learnt and the feedback available after the cloudburst incident of mid july have all been incorporated in our plans we have our avalanche rescue teams our mountain rescue teams and other teams of other security forces also deployed on the critical areas simultaneously we are also keeping these areas under surveillance our casualty helipad evacuation for evacuation as well as upgraded medical facilities all along the 32 km foot track are absolutely effective and in place to correspond and to supplement that the civil administration medical setup is also in place we have had the opportunity of doing joint exercise rehearsals with the security forces establishments as also the national disaster management authority the ndrf and the sdrf teams besides this the indian army has put its resources like the tents in the yatri shivers or the yatri camps which are at panchtarni and noonwan and which has resulted in augmenting the capacity of these camps for the yatris towards the end i would once again reassure indian army's commitment in supporting the civil administration and the shrine board in our efforts to ensure that this year's yatra is safe and incident free thank you and jai hind